Ooh, they done cut the grass, you too. This is amazing. This looks amazing to me. The grass is cut. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, Louisville. Thank you. I appreciate you. All right. I still look around, though. I still can walk up on a no show. I don't want that. I don't need a no show in my life. I don't went to the gym. Got me a great workout in. Got the heart, the heart help. And uh, now it's time for me to have fun and do what I love to do. And I can do this on a daily basis. Getting paid or not, it's about fun to me. Passion. Y'all let me know if y'all like that last video of the, of the spot I found uh, with, when I caught the crappie. That was, that was pretty interesting to catch those crappies in uh, shallow, shallow, shallow water. You guys, I ain't gonna lie. And I mean shallow water. Let's see if any uh, bluegill hanging around here. It should be some hanging around here too. Yep, see, you saw, you saw that? So I can, uh, ooh, they just tapping away. I can downsize and catch bluegills all day long, but I'm gonna also throw out here just to see if I can catch a crappie. A last, uh, it's about what? It, what is it like? Made a 11 or 12? Let me see if I can catch a crappie over here, right here. That's why I normally catch them when they hear them. But this year, this year was weird though. They just wasn't. I didn't catch them around right this way. I'm gonna play with these bluegill for a while and I might start bass fishing. Downsize that 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 lure to a very, very small. I'm gonna catch a bluegill every time I, ca I cast over there. I don't know if they're gonna be big. They probably will be decent, but not big. Then one pound that got me spoiled. I ain't never seen nothing like that in my life. Let me make sure this is going for me. Oh yeah, it's going. It's going, YouTube. I just wanted to make sure. All right, let's get back over there. He hit that 116 out of that road runner. See if anything else will hit it. Watch it start popping. There we go. Look at that. You see that? Ooh, he let it go. He let it go. Let it go. They are all right here in this corner, you guys. You, you see that? Yep, I'm finna switch over here. I love playing with these little fish. I love playing with these little big fish. Tapping it. Tapping it, but I ain't getting it. You see that? Ooh, that line just going. All right, let me switch over. And he got my, and he got my, uh, my Bobby Garland off of it. So let me switch it over. I'm gonna show you guys something here. All right, you two, here we go. So this is what we're gonna be fishing with right there. It's very, very small, you guys, like a penny, size of a penny. We we'll see what happens. I'm sure I got something in here. That I can put on here. Okay, I can go with these. I can go with these right here. They kind of look like a uh, blue ice or blue thunder. That's probably blue ice. Look like a small metal. All right, so it's gonna be the first cast with this little one-inch lure. Okay, he got, he got someone over there. I should get a bite though. There we go, you see that? Oh man, he's having a drag. This is a good bluegill. Or it might be a bass. Oh, that's a bluegill. Ooh, that thing was pulling. All right, you see that? Oh, that's a nice one, you guys. That's a good one. That's a good bluegill right there. That is a good bluegill. I'm gonna let you guys get a better look at this. 
well you guys can see very pretty male bluegill i might not even need uh that the crappie bite it need to be fixed though now i might have to put the crappie bites on you guys either i'm gonna get a hit or they're gonna take that off they're popping the line Yep, got that joke off that quick. There we go, you got one. I think got another one. Oh yeah, they nice. They very nice right here. Very, very nice. I Man, I could I could live with these. If I was if Oh, that's a nice hammer. Got me. Hammer hooked me. If that was uh, if this was all I was can catch, oh yeah, they can go with me. They can, they can really go with me. There we go. Okay. There we go. That's a good cast. One more. Maybe. There we go. Ooh, he hit that nice. Uh, but if these things were probably about, I'll say, three pounds, pound for pound, they'd be the real deal. That's a good one. That is a real good one. Pretty big, got a, got a nice got a little hump going there. Very pretty, very pretty. I think they right over in that in, in front of that uh there we go got another one this one ain't that big though green fish so this is what i caught yesterday now look how small that is and that green fish yesterday was a pound and two ounces and some people will take this home he thick he thick though See if there's any bluegills right here, YouTube. Gonna see if they made it in, which they should be. They should be all. This is where they spawn. There's onto my thousands of them, hundreds bigger than what I wanted, but I go with it. There we go. little split shot now I put the crappie bite on now they get to the bottom if I can drag it off the bottom we'll see what happened we'll see what happened here there we go let's let it get down there should be on the bottom now and just bring, there we go you know what i'm saying went right out there and got in the bed good one too you guys there we go first first blue oh it's a nice one first bluegill off of the uh rock pile of the year there you go first bluegill off the rock pile it's a male you see it pen all right, I might not need the crappie uh, nibbles, but we'll go with it just to get the footage. That's what I'm fishing with, uh, 164 jig head, a one inch tube, pink and chartreuse, and then tip with a crappie nibble. Small split shot about four inches above that. 
Let it sit to that bottom and the, and the, the gills will do the rest. And you gotta let it go on the bottom. So watch that line till it drop. Once it drop, just make see if it twitch or do anything. Or you can slowly reel it back. And see if they hit it. And normally they'll just tighten it up. It's not stacked. They're not stacked here yet because if they, did, if they were, that's gonna take off as soon as they hit the ground. Actually, they hit it floating down there. Hey, we, ooh, saw the line. They out there. They are out there. But they ain't, but they ain't super busy. They got that witch call on. They got that copy bite off. You can see. You guys have red worms. You'll catch me every time you throw out there. I can feel them. I can feel them kind of bumping this thing. I'm halfway through, so I'm just putting one on at a time. Sometimes I put two, but not today. My little friend here, the the the, the Stark or wherever that thing is, crane. If I get if I catch another one, I'm gonna give it to him. There we go, you guys. There we go. This is a nice bluegill, you guys. Uh, they, they good. They just strong. You see that one? Ooh, that's looking nice. Look at this. Look at this one right here. Pretty, pretty. I think, I'm gonna feed the Stark, watch this. See that Stark watching me, watch this. See, you see? I'm grabbing it. I probably didn't throw it down for enough. So I don't know if he's gonna get it. He's probably scared to get it because of me. Go back to fishing. I think he's just waiting on it to move. He don't know where it's at. It's in that grass. But if it moves, flop. It's gone. That fish, and that fish might see it. So it just ain't gonna flop. <laughs> see if I can get another one here. Get him on the bottom. There we go. We got another one, you guys. Got another one. They strong. They swim all the way to me. They, ooh, they get nice out here. Look at that one right there. Big boy, look at that one. Look at that one, you two. Man, that's a nice one. I'm gonna see if he'll eat this one then. There you go, he took off with you. See him get it? He got it. He gonna eat that other one too. Uh, once he find it, once it moves. He turned the head first, and then he just, there you go, going down the body, going down the neck, still in the neck, still in the neck, in the stomach now. Now he drinks some water, wash it down. 
I think it's still in the neck. Okay, it's gone. Yep. It's gone. The neck got skinny. Let me see if I can get him another one. Let's see if I can get him another one. Yeah, I'm gonna feed my feed my friend right quick. Get him nice and full. I guess he just wanted it one. Oh, no, he's still over there. Let me see if I can get him another one. I should get one on this cast. So wait till it land on the bottom. Now it's slack. And just barely move it till it tighten up. So you can get it, watch. You hear it. You hear it moving. That first one that, that, that I, uh, there we go. Remember that first one? There you go, he got him. That first one I threw over there, I ain't gonna give him no more after that. He got two big ones. Agent, going down the mouth, head first. Bam, it's gone. He's in the neck, now he drink water. If he can't get it down, he'll drink water. There you go, he finger some water. He might not need it from the first time. He don't need it. And they'll sit there and he'll sit here, he'll probably eat about 10 of these things if I throw it to him. That joke is greedy. He come about, he come around every time I come out here. He won't come too close to me though, but he'll he'll come and get that fish. There you go, we got another one, you guys. Way out there. Way out there. It's a good one. They all good, honestly. They all are good. See how they put in that drag a little bit? Ooh, they all are nice. You too. These the rocks, the famous rocks that I be talking about. Look at that. Look at that. I'm gonna feed him another one. That's my friend right there. I gotta help him out. He got him. He got him. That's three. I might get them by five of them. Then out some of these bluegills in this water, man. It's, it's millions of them. You can't, you can't, you can't out harvest them. They spawn so much. Them and the crappies. And I got that one way out there. On the bottom. Ooh, there we go. I missed him. I know he got that crappy bite though. Yep. You see that? I almost pulled it off. I almost pulled it off. So he kind of full now, guys, because he haven't ate that fish yet. He got it, though. He ain't going to let it go to waste. He just got it in his mouth down there. But he got two already in him, so he kind of full. That's all he needs. He don't need no more. There we go. I should get one on this bite, you guys. Remember, let it hit the bottom with the jig. There you go. And just slowly, slowly bring it back until that line tighten up. side because I do want to catch a couple bass today. I'm going to go on that side over there and cast along the sh uh, shoreline. He just ate it. Ooh, look at that. He hit that. He hit that while wow, just sitting there. I'm about to show y'all that the uh birds he swallowed, he drank that water. 
he's swallowing it now, but look, here, here go another nice one. They are pretty out here, healthy fish. Clean water, clean, healthy water. You don't see no sores on the fish. None of that stuff, just healthy. All the fish are healthy out here. All of them. We got it loaded up, and we're gonna get in here. It's a little, little bitty split shot you got. You just want enough to just get it down there. And um, throw it out there, let it sit on that bottom, and you're kind of dragging it through their beds. And when it get loaded, it's early right now, but when it get loaded, they'll hit that as soon as they hit the water. Now, if you have some um, red worms right now, you'll be catching them a lot faster than what I'm catching. You'll be catching them back to back. You can catch you 50 of them real quick. You want it? You want it to? There we go. Got another one. Got another one. These little boogers can fight, boy. These little jokers can fight. And they are pretty, man. Look at them right there. They got some size on them out here. They're not massive, but they got some size. Oh, shoot. Calm down. Calm down. I think this is the uh, long ear mixed with the, with the bluegill. Cause they're a little thicker. They be a little thicker than the other one. He got like some worm in his mouth there. But there you go. It's a male. No, nah, maybe not. Maybe a female. You know, bee come out. Something else came out. There you go. Pretty. All right. The wind blowing, so fishing through the wind, you guys. A little harder than I wanted to be. Here we go, you guys. You saw that? Just let him run. I got thin line, guys. I got thin line. Give him a net. He's barely hooked, too. I got him good. I got him good. There we go. Yeah. That top water got him. Came up and hit it. About a two pounder. I don't. I don't play with the treble hooks, you guys. They get, to, they get to jumping around, they get you some fish. There you go. And that's why I got him with a torpedo. Let's weigh it and see how much it weighs. I'd say a pound and a half, maybe right at two pounds. That's 1.7. 1.7 weight. There you go. Pretty little bass. I think she's full of eggs. 